So it's Friday, so we're up in the mood. And it's time for the NCA menus, of course. Now, first off, Paul Rudd is People's 2021 Sexiest Man Alive. Hmm. Hmm. American actor, screenwriter, and producer Paul Rudd has been crowned People's Magazine Sexiest Man Alive for 2021. Reacting to the news, the Ant-Man star stated that he knew a lot of people would receive the news with so much mixed hmm. feelings. He said, and I'm quoting, I do not have an awareness enough to know that when people hear that I'll be picked for this, they'll say, what? This is not false humility. There are so many people that should get this before me. Now that he's the sexiest man alive, Paul added, I'm hoping now that I'll finally be invited to some of those sexy dinners with Clooney and Pitt and B. Jordan. And I figure I'll be on a lot more yachts. I'm excited to expand my yachting life and I'll be probably try to get better at brooding in really soft light. <laughs> I like to ponder and I think this is going to help me become more inward and mysterious. And I'm looking forward to that. He also revealed that despite the stardom that comes with his career, he's happiest at home with his wife and kids. He said, and I'm still quoting, when I think about myself, I think of myself as a husband, as a father, like I'm that. I just hang out with my family when I'm not working. That's what I kind of like the most. Last year's honoree was actor Michael B. Jordan, while John Legend held the title the year before. Hmm. So people have been reacting to this, and you know that, I don't know, maybe it's just a thing when they say man of the year and people, uh, some people will not just I like agree. it. Yeah. Agree. So yeah, it was very right when he said that people will receive it with mixed feelings. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, I think that when it comes to that, a lot of people, of like course, have a lot this of guy, now I've forgotten his name, this Bridgerton guy wasn't there. Uh, and <laughs> his French name. Like, um, um, something, uh, John, something. John, Reggae John. Uh -huh. Reggae John. He wasn't there. Uh, when it was uh, Robert Pattinson for Most Handsome, Most Beautiful Man Alive, I was like, huh? You know, how did he beat Kanye? But it's okay. I mean, to each their own. Maybe the eye that is beholding is seeing what they are saying. <laughs> But I absolutely love his reaction. He's like, it's going to be brooding more in soft light. I just him. imagine him like, Whoop. okay, <laughs> with natural light hitting his face. I'm talking about the yacht life, though. Yeah, mm. because one yeah. time, even for the, uh, I think it was People People Magazine, uh, the named um, Lupita the most beautiful human or beautiful the woman, woman in yeah. the world, and Ooh. you know. Uh, so at that point, you know, Lupita was everywhere. Yeah. But now, you know, it depends on you. I mean, you know, when it comes to that, it can be relative, especially when it comes to like most, and then mm -hmm. you are like, uh, wait a minute. Like, <laughs> in the world. Yeah, but <laughs> in the world, but wow. it depends on what you're trying to like tell people. Mm -hmm. Are you trying to say that, oh, this person is black and they've mm -hmm. come to stay and black is beautiful mm. and you know, and all that. So it depends on what you're actually uh, trying to okay, say um, to people. I'm, I'm definitely one of the people that, uh, this was meant to be to me feelings <laughs> because i'm like when you say the sexiest man i'm like i wouldn't look at him like that and he, like i would look at him the way he described himself i'm a father mm -hmm. a husband i'm like that's how i see him who's the sexiest i'm like um how about so the like, legend so i'm putting year. him and like idris elba i'm putting him and, like, elba, I, I Jordan. Him in, um, i'm putting him and jason before. momoa and i'm like uh not see that for me. i think we're thinking about him 10 years ago <laughs> 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 I watch you recently. Well, maybe Jason but, Momoa for me, but I'm just like, because he just looks like a nerd. Like, he looks like he would be doing like IT and stuff. Oh he looks like that. I don't know. He looks like that person that helps you do assignments in school. He doesn't give oh me I, I feel sexy like vibes. This is, this is what we're fed our minds. Because when you think back to when people who probably made this list were yeah. 15, 16, when you think to all the rom coms, all the yeah. Harley Quinn novels, there was always a look blue eyes. Brown yeah, hair, hair those, cheekbones. I feel like that's what's going on here. I mean, need to actually infuse more of, you know, that's why they keep saying um, yeah. inclusiveness. Different types of people. People, so beauty, people can, different yeah, beauty. Different yeah, different standards yeah, of yeah, beauty. Yeah, maybe right. this will change. But for now, we're still stuck with this well, kind that, of thing. that's valid. Mm. I mean, maybe it's sexy to people. Mm. I so, think so, because, you know... It's just the most for me. You, like, you know, mm. yes, you know I talk about pretty privilege all the time, and yeah. I always like to say that, you know, the way you see things, if you just think that there is a standard for... Uh, the mainstream media, mm -hmm. and then this is these are the beautiful people. What happens to the rest of the people? Like, are they the beautiful ones? Are they are they are okay. <laughs> if you're not there, then let me start to take you. <laughs>